Hey, what is up guys? So this is trip number one of three, putting in time on the Colorado River, looking for the big boys. And on this day, we launch out of Willow Beach and we decide that we are gonna go downriver and we end up going down about six or seven miles on the kayaks. And it was right at that point when I got the first and only hookup of the day. It came out of a complete surprise, so I did not have the cameras rolling. So we're going to bring you right to the action, right when it happens. Check it out, guys. I got a monster, bro. Get in there! Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Oh, look at that guy. That's what we came out here for. I am gonna keep this one, so bonked him, got him knocked out, put him out of his misery, and then uh, gilled him. I'm just gonna let him bleed out. The water's real cold here, so we're just gonna keep him in the water, keep him nice and fresh until we take him home. I got cooler advice already. We're done. That was awesome. Damn, that was fun. And that's going to be the only fish that we hook up on on this trip guys i like to say that we caught this fish on the savage gear line through trout shout out to my boy dustin for, for hooking me up with this lure and after paddling four and a half hours back that was going to be it for this trip so let's go ahead and get on to trip number two of three on the colorado river Right, trip number two of three on the river guys so on this trip we're on a short day I'm getting out there late I've only got about four hours so I decide I'm gonna go up river two hours and I figure it's gonna take me two to get back and right at that two hour mark as I'm beginning to turn around I get my first and only hookup of the day and I catch a big boy uh, and unfortunately my mic was not plugged in all the way so the only audio we're gonna get is from the front mic I apologize guys but let's go ahead and check it out that one on the line not sure what size he is Down all the way at the bottom, guys. Try to get him around this side again.
there yet, guys. I'm gonna get him in the boat. We're having dinner tonight, guys. Yes. It took me about an hour and a half to paddle back and I was done for the day. Like I said, I only have about four hours to fish on this trip, but I'm super stoked because I just caught my personal best striped bass. I did weigh it after I got back, it weighed about 10 pounds after bleeding it. So I'd say around 10 pounds guys. I'd also like to quickly thank Tony from Real Vegas Fishing Crew for making me my custom trout plug that I caught this fish on. He does amazing work, so thank you very much, Tony. And a quick shout out to Derek. I ran into Derek on the water on the way back. He said he was a subscriber, and I appreciate you coming up and saying what's up, bud. And trip two is a wrap, guys. Let's go ahead and get the trip three, the last river trip of October. Check it out. What is up? We're back at Willow Beach. And uh, I'm with Chris again. He's just chilling. Hey, we're going downstream, brother. I know, that's why I'm sweating and taking the back <laughs> but Yeah, this is a third river trip, most recent. Downstream the first time, upstream last time, then we're going back downstream. And then uh, we plan on doing some bait fishing as well. So I think we're going to get the trolling, get the plugs out, and do our thing. Goal is one fish, huh? For me, at least. For me. That's always the goal when you come to this spot. Yeah, it happens, man. So we're gonna get these out and then we'll return with some action if we get some action. I don't wanna be recording this at all day. All right, we got out about 6.30, 6.45. It is now almost eight o'clock. Uh, slow, no action just yet. But it's still early. The sun's just barely coming up over these mountains for uh, what time it is. It being uh, end of October, so. So it's checking in, eight o'clock. So we trolled around for about an hour or so and decided we we're going to find a spot that was deep enough, drop the anchor down, tie up, you know, chill out and just get to some bait fishing. It's been a while since I did any kind of bait fishing um, and this is actually the first time doing some bait fishing in the Colorado River. So let's check out how the rest of the day went for us. All right, we got Chris on a fish. How about that, baby? How's it going? What have you got, dog? No way, it broke off. Oh no. Yep. Hit that hook next time, homie. Damn. We're... Yeah. Gotta set that hook. I know. That's what I didn't do. I got excited. Oh well. Next time. Hey man, look, still got some bait. Oh well. Sorry guys. That was exciting for a moment. No. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Picked up on something. We don't know what it is yet, but it actually pulling kind of decent. Looks like a catfish. Is it? Yep. See? What happens when you fish off the bottom? See? Decent size, dude. Doing this little spin. Oh, that's a good size. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna try to get him off right here. Get out. Big go climber, huh? Ooh, got him off good, dude. First fish is A. No skunk. Damn. Got another one. I don't know what it is yet, though. On that. Is that a catfish, dog. Yep. It's not another fatty, though. Look at him. This is barely got his lip. Damn. Look at him, guys. 
Oh, there you go. He's down. See ya. Nice. There you go, Tove. Nice fight. Yeah. Oh, he's pulling. Yeah, you got the jag just right now. There you go. Nice big guy. Look at him. Ooh, Look at that belly. Little monster. Look at that thing. Yes. Yeah? Good job. There you go. He's gone. Yes, he has some good size to him, bro. Right? He put up a little that fight. A, that was the biggest fish you've probably caught in a while. Probably. Able to adjust it. Oh, me too, bro. Come on. Might be a catfish if I had to guess. Yep. He's another. He's another fat guy. Ooh. Belly. That looks like that same one, dude. Peace. That was it. Alright. It's about 2 o'clock and we are just about back in to Google Beach. Today was a pretty chill day. Only got on some cats, some cats today. It was cool. No skunk for us. But we're gonna head in, put everything away, and dip. Hoping to get on at least one striper today. Unfortunately, down the river was not the way to go today. Next time we'll probably try going up river. We didn't see much people going this way either. So probably switch it up next time. Definitely gonna keep putting in time here and trying to get on a big boy. So that's gonna be it for today. Chris, Brendan, peace out.